What's going on guys? Welcome back to Ramcast Sports. My name is Cam Meyer. I'm Rams Carver. And today we're here with three high school soccer players for the Rams. If you guys would like to introduce yourselves. Uh, I'm Ashton Wagner. I'm, an, I'm a sophomore. Isaac Graver. I'm also a sophomore. Alistair Clody. I'm a junior. So how has the season gone for you guys so far? It's been pretty good. I think we've, we've definitely done better than these guys did last year. Obviously I wasn't there, but I've, I've heard what's happened, right? <laughs> And, I don't know, we started pretty well. We've had some good games. We've had some good wins. I mean, what do you guys think? Uh, you know, it's been all right. I can't really say much. We've lost a lot. But we're better than last year, so that's all that really matters. Um, I think we've been playing a lot better this year than last year. I mean, we only lost one starter from last season to this season. So I think having that extra year of all of us playing together last year <coughs> prepared us pretty well for this year. Uh, what are some ways to uh, like surpass the 500 mark? 500? Like like, oh, like yeah. even <laughs> record? Like like get over uh, the even record? Yeah. Hmm. So I think I mean we're we're halfway through the season now. I think so. We we do have quite a few rough games. We've got to play Marion twice. We have some rough games on the road, but we also have some games I think are definitely winnable. There's a lot there, especially with the improvement. We've got some new players coming in couple freshmen who have been playing in during, for varsity and they've been doing really, really well. I think if we go hard in practice, we keep training the way we have, I think there's a good chance that we can we can get the wins we need and we could maybe even win a regionals. I think we definitely have the potential. Yeah, I totally agree with that. We've gotten a lot better as a team and individuals and I think we could, yeah, maybe win regionals if we try hard enough. I think we're definitely capable of playing to our competitors level. So as long as we just keep level heads and go and do it with a strong attitude and determination, we can definitely match any team's capabilities. Yeah. Uh, kind of touching on what you said, Isaac, is there anyone that has like stood out in your perspective? Yeah, so I think two people specifically, Blake Sanders and Kiko Koch, both of them have been have been incredible this season. I know they have each of them have, I think maybe even one or two hat tricks this season. Blake had an incredible goal outside the box in a recent home game. Those two, I think, have been our main goal scorers. They really set the tone for the team going into games. They have the right attitude. They keep our spirits high when things maybe aren't going the best, and they really, they really do set the tone for the team. Anyone else? I think this guy right here has been standing <laughs> out. A little brick wall on the defensive line. I try my best. Saves my butt sometimes, too. <laughs> So we play Effingham on the 26th. What are you guys going to do to prepare for the Flaming Hearts? So, you know, training it has been going really, really well for us. Uh, I don't think we know a ton about Effingham. I know I don't personally know their record, but we've we've heard some stuff about them. And I think, again, yeah, keep going hard in training. Everyone does their job. I think we have a good chance. I think Effingham is a hard team to prepare for because they're very unpredictable season to season. Yeah. I mean. Or my freshman year, two years ago, we beat them 9-6. to six. It was our only win of the season. And then this past year, we lost to them in completely different players. I mean, it was just a different team we were playing. So I think walking into it with no expectations and just sort of meeting them where they're at is our best bet right now. And their record, they have a very nice record, but they've been playing a lot of small schools that we never get to see during the season. Yeah. All right. Uh, so, Isaac, you touched on earlier, you weren't here last season. You're a sophomore, yeah. though. So how has this season gone, and how has it been different from any other soccer team you've been on? I think it's been a really good experience so far. You know, I'm not used to training every day per week. When I play club soccer, we have two trainings each week. We have a game on the weekend. That's it. That's all the time, all the contact I get with my teammates. I think this kind of environment where I'm seeing these guys every single day in the classroom, on the field, all that stuff, it really helps bring the team closer, at least for me. That's what it's been. And it helps with, you know, the way we play. Because when we're good friends, we know the way each other act on the field. We know how to play well together as a team. I think it's, that's been a great experience for me. I feel like acquaintances more than co exactly. yeah. 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 Okay, guys. So September 30th, the Rams soccer team will play Massac County. So make sure to pop out of that if you are able to. It will be in Ken Hunt Stadium. And that's all we got for you this week. I've been Cam Meyer. I'm Aaron Scrubber. And we'll see you next week. Peace. <laughs> All right, so as you heard here first, what the? What? What am I talking about? <laughs> you heard it. You heard it here first, folks.